Okay guys, this is my second video. In my last video I showed you how to improve your system and gaming performance. Today I'm going to show you something similar to my last video. Uh, again, I will say it like in my last video, I won't push you to subscribe, comment, rate or anything. Just thank you for watching my video. I like posting uh, videos on YouTube to offer uh, my knowledge uh, to other people. Okay, today I'm going to be showing you two programs to clean and speed up your PC. To clean and speed up your PC. So, one thing, it's not an antivirus program. Don't, lo don't download any antivirus programs uh, because they slow down your computer a lot. There are a lot of other programs uh, you can use to clean up and speed up your computer and clean them for viruses, of course. So, you can check my last video just type in in YouTube how to improve your system and game performance okay so the first thing you want to do is uh, go to your browser the first program I'm going to be showing you is uh, TuneUp Utilities okay let's say 2013 uh, go to the CNET download website cnetdownload.com all the download links will be put in the description box below so below the video in the description box uh, just click on download now and it's gonna start downloading I'm not gonna do that now since I've already done that uh, when you install TuneUp Utilities 2013 it's gonna run, run a program automa automatically when the installation finishes it's called uh, TuneUp one click, one click Maintenance I don't know if I pronounced that right so it's gonna scan your computer, uh, scan your registry, clean up Windows programs, blah, 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 browser cookies, and so on. Optimize system startup and shutdown. Okay. So anyways, uh, open your TuneUp Utilities program. Uh, if you want to switch it to economy, to economy mode, uh, that's made uh, for laptops. Switch to economy mode so you can save battery life, or you can switch to turbo like I did just when you first time for the first time click on turbo mode it's going to ask you to check some boxes i've checked all the boxes so the more boxes you check uh, the your computer the more your computer runs faster so uh, next uh, you can go to optimize your computer you can i recommend to disable your programs that you don't need of course Okay, so here are all the installed programs. Now, okay, the maintenance is finished. Just click on Run Maintenance. Optimization completed, no system interference, so that's it. Uh, in the Tuna program deactivator, just you can disable there everything that you don't need, of course. So, Microsoft Office Word, I haven't been using that for a long time, so I'm just going to disable it. See how the rates fall, fall down. I'm just going to disable uTorrent. I only activate it when I need to download some something, I don't know. Okay, everything here is disabled that I don't need. So, that's it for the TuneUp program deactivator. Next. So... If you see this, this this is the problem timeline. 67% uh, optimiz optimiz optimization program uh, achieved. Sorry. So on the blank timeline, you're gonna see, uh, those are the problems that are that the TuneUp thinks that are um, bad for your computer. For example, unused potential. Here it is. There are six problems. Blah blah blah. blah. Click on the problems. Yeah, no firewall program is enabled. I don't need firewall. No antivirus program is enabled. No, n never. User account, blah, 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 blah. And so it's going to show you the programs here. The problems, sorry, that are shown on your computer. So you can you can enable automatic updates for Windows if you want. So it's not a big deal. And so that's practically it for TuneUp Utilities 2013. Next program I'm going to be showing you is the malware bytes anti malware program it's something like the same 
like an antivirus program, I don't know. So just type in Google malware bytes. So again, I repeat, I'm gonna put all the down links in the description box below the video. Click on again Cine download.com. Click on download now. Since I already downloaded that, I'm, gonna, I'm not gonna download it again. Install the program. After the install, oh, sorry, I'm gonna switch to standard mode. Okay, now so just uh, run the program. Malware bytes and malware. Uh, when you install it, it's gonna ask you to perform a quick scan, deep system scan, or um, an advanced system scan, so uh, something only those files you want to scan. So I only need to uh, perform a quick scan, that's uh, something that I recommend highly. So don't uh, do at the beginning perform a full scan, you can do that later. So that's a full system scan. Just click on uh, just tick the box uh, perform quick scan, click on scan. And uh, when the scan finishes, because uh, it's not that a fast scan, it's not that a quick scan. So when the program finishes, uh, here uh, instead of abort scan, it's gonna uh, a button will appear that says the show results. Click on show results. Uh, one more window will pop up. You'll you'll see the problems your computer has. Some will be unticked. So just tick them. Click on everything that you want to disable. If you know what I mean, I hope so. And just click on. I don't remember what exactly it says. It says to clean uh, the viruses or delete them. I don't know. You can put them in quarantine or something. I don't know. But I uh, recommend that you tick everything. Tick everything the malware bytes has scanned, and just delete them. So uh, one more thing before I finish my video. I'm gonna show you. Uh, one more trick that many of you maybe didn't didn't know on how to uh, increase your program speed set their prior priority uh, so they run up pretty much faster than usual so open up your start uh, start task manager click on start task manager sorry or just hold control alt delete and for example, here's TuneUp Utilities. It doesn't matter if it's a game or a program. It doesn't matter. Just click on right click. Just uh, right click on it, sorry. Uh, set priority and set to high, for example. Or you can set priority, you can set it to real time. Doesn't matter. If you want to save your battery life, just click on set priority. Normal, normal below normal, or low. So that's gonna save your RAM memory uh, or random access memory, doesn't matter and uh, save your battery life so that's uh, it for this video thanks for watching and i will repeat again i won't push you to subscribe comment rate or anything i'll try to find the keys to activate your programs in this in the description box below although you don't need to do that you have the 30 day trial or month, one month trial to use that program so i don't think you'll need to activate that key you need the, I don't think you need the key activation uh, sorry I'm kind of messed up today my speech is messy and sorry for that so I repeat again you I won't push you to su subscribe comment rate or anything just taking for watching my video I offer my knowledge so that's it thanks I hope I'll keep posting more videos so I can offer some help goodbye